Hey everyone, Marco here from the My Color Screen channel and welcome to the very first episode of My Color Screen Weekly. In this episode, is Neon the new Long Shadow? Are Themes the new Icon Packs? And I say OK Google a lot. Let's get started. So first up, we have two brand new Icon Packs that were released this very week. First up, there's the incredible Lunar UI Icon Pack by the very popular GFX devs. Everything about this pack simply screams fun. The icons themselves are flat, slightly minimal, and bursting with color, like vibrant stickers painted on the tiny canvas that is your Android device. Over 410 Full HD icons, 9 Full HD wallpapers, an icon request tool, and with frequent updates, you know that you're surely going to be getting your money's worth with this icon pack. Next up, we have Neon Moonshine, and no, it's not a tasty cocktail from your local nightclub, but instead the designer Bryonic Themes has taken the Google Moonshine icons and added his own unique flair to them. Technically, it's not an icon pack per se, but rather an entire theme, bundled with a wallpaper manager that comes with over 30 KitKat style wallpapers in glowing neon colors, a custom neon clock widget, dock bar styles, as well as let's not forget those incredible looking icons. Over 2,450 neon icons in ultra crisp triple X HDPI resolution or make your screen look like an Enter the Void movie poster. Both of these icon packs are truly impressive, so go and give them a test drive today. Moving on to custom ROM themes, where you can see what they're all about in this video right over there. Just simply click the link. You can create incredible icons, that's great. Then you move on to superb looking widgets, that's even better. So where do you go to from there? How about custom ROM themes? The infamous JP Fulldagger or Black Bear Blanc has now moved his focus onto Cyanogen mod themes. His first and certainly not last theme is titled Red. This badass CM11 theme blends both minimal icons and in your face red accents throughout your phone. Toggles have been replaced with elegant red and gray text and overall, the theme feels solid and you can easily spot that professional, minimal feel we've all grown to love from Black Bear Blanc. Next up, unleash your primal instincts with Creature UI by Screenlicious, the designer that has an eye for knowing exactly what looks good on your phone. Opting for a soft pastel-like green, this CM theme by Nikolai is actually quite breathtaking. All your main UI such as the quick settings, notification bar, the general settings, even Gmail, the pop-ups and the CM torch all get that full creature treatment, while other apps still get a few accents which is really neat. More updates are on the way from these themes so you definitely want to keep both of them on your radar. And finally, for our interesting story of the day, thanks to our new exposed module titled OK Google for third party launches, you now have the option to say OK Google for third party launches. Once only available to the Google Now launcher, you're now able to say this popular phrase with any one of your favorite launchers. For example, this is with Thema. OK Google. This is using Nova Launcher. OK Google. This is using an iPhone. OK Google. OK, probably not every launcher. So that's it for now guys. Now moving on to our question of the week. Where do you see icon designs moving in the future? Long shadows are slowly phasing out. So what do you think the next big design trend will be? Let us know in the comments section below. Other than that, if you enjoyed this new video, please give it a thumbs up as well as to please subscribe to the My Color Screen channel. And of course, don't forget to join our various social communities. And last but not least, don't forget to check out My Color Screen's official one-click theming launcher titled Thema Beta, available free from the Google Play Store. Other than that, Marco here from the My Color Screen channel. And as always, don't stop customizing.